Alright, let me show you how I switch between CarPlay, Android Auto, and Mirror Link on via Beck's head unit. If you want your phone to auto connect to CarPlay every time you start the car, just go into the settings and turn on background connection. But if you only want to use Bluetooth and skip CarPlay, just turn on Wi-Fi, disconnect CarPlay, and turn off background connection. That'll stop the auto reconnect. So first, I'm gonna tap the home button right here in the middle. That brings up all the modes I can choose from. I just tap the one I want, and boom, the name of the feature shows up right here. Super easy. I'm opening the Bluetooth app, tapping, search. And there it is, that's my iPhone Bluetooth name. I'll double tap it. A pairing request pops up on my phone, I tapping, pair, and allow. Give it a few seconds, and it's connected. Once Bluetooth is paired, it auto-launches the Z-Link app, and starts the wireless CarPlay setup. A CarPlay connection request has appeared on my phone, I'm tapping, connect. And just like that, we're in. Couldn't be smoother. Just open the Kalos app, follow the steps on your phone, and you're good to go with screen mirroring. Perfect for when you're parked or just chilling in the car. If the connection takes more than 40 seconds, just open your iPhone's Wi-Fi settings and tap on the car radio's hotspot name to connect, it'll connect right away. And the next time you connect, wireless CarPlay will pair up much faster automatically.